Right, morning guys. A quick update on the Mini. We've got uh, all the repair sections in the side to reduce the size of the aperture. We put the screen in with the rubber around it just to make sure that everything fits together before we fully weld it and do our repairs and then get it painted. So this is where we're up to now. We've just got those bits tacked in down the side. Went in okay actually. Little bit of trimming and fettling. So now we need to get the screen back out again. Get welded up. Then we can do our repair work. Welded up, there you go. Let's get the other side done. Hi, guys, um, back in the paint mixing room. Um, as you can see, we've got the Cadillac all set up, ready to paint. We just paint it through the bottoms where there's a few little repairs. Um, as we mentioned yesterday um, about the color that we've made for this car. Um, these are the spray out cards and different mixes we've done to try and get it. Seven of them and they all take a little bit of time. But we're really confident we've got it right now. Um, this is the process. This is our Wave 2.0. Duncan mixing the paint. Concentration place. Sorry, concentration. This is a system. So you can see how many tinters this colour's got in it. Um, seven all together, eight sorry, plus a water base, uh, dilutant, not sure what colour's going in at the moment, not sure what are we on Duncan? 412. Oh golden yellow, okay, so we basically started out of a spectro reading, this is our spectrometer of the colour, which wasn't too bad, and then to be honest we just took it from there ourselves and we normally just add or take a colour away yeah so we just um, maybe uh, look at the colour in the direct sunlight against the car and what we will do is just decide what way the colour wants to go and then just add or subtract some colours just to you know get it where we need it but Duncan will have this mixed up soon and we're going to get a little bit of footage of him in the booth painting this one so we'll come back to you soon. Ghost Brother. Let's go. <laughs> yes. Here we go, Duncan, what gun are you gonna be using? Yeah. <laughs> well that's getting bleak. <laughs> I got a W4. I'm gonna come in with you. Let's go then.
using the blowers and then we can go with the drop coat and then finally the lacquer. Right, so the Cadillac's painted now, all demasked. Um, I'm not sure if you've seen this yet, but there it is, what a beast. So as you saw a bit earlier, we painted right around the bottom. This is no full waterborne base coat um, for the color with Noval 56500 clear coat. This has got a five minute bake time at 60 degrees. So for these sort of jobs, you know, you can turn them around really quickly, get them out the door. As you can see, we are not got to polish it, just fine with a gun finish. Here you go. We painted these wheel arches um, just to get the colour blended, but Another one done. Custom can have it back for the weekend. Happy days. Right, so the Mini's now in the booth. It's 10 to six. We need to get some epoxy prime on this tonight before we go home. So tomorrow we can start doing the filler work. Um, there it is, all prepped up, ready for its epoxy. We always epoxy our bare steel. Nice to have that waterproof layer between the bare steel and your filler. So tomorrow we can come in here, start getting the filler work done, get this prepped up and get some paint on it. So another one coming to its end. Right guys, thanks for watching this video. I um, hope you enjoyed it. It's starting to feel a bit worn out tonight. It's been a long day, plenty going on. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. Look, if you like what we do, um, subscribe to our channel, hit that bell notification so you can see all our upcoming videos and we'll see you in the next one.